house with a falling down barn. Bottles strung through old tree branches, clinked at night when the air was calm and smashed when it blew hard. The skins of foxes and wild hares hung from a weather-worn porch, while the future prey hid in their lair their eyes glowing beneath a torch. In the barn my father worked, killing kept him employed, and in the house that secrets built there lived his wife and boy, who hung like a chain around his neck and robbed him of his joy. Within the town that lay nearby, quite often a mob would gather to stalk the hills and countryside, mad dogs, searching for something madder. My father would disappear from time to time. I would watch his ghostly visage slip away, and he committed God knows what foul crime whose guessing kept me up for days. When sleeping came and nightmares too, I saw visions of my father stalking naked prey. His voice a slither of cruel laughter, there was no peace in the light of day. My mother was a silent woman who wore a mask of tears. It's almost as if she wasn't there, her memory has faded through the years. She cleaned and cooked for father and I and never asked, nor received any thanks. And in the cupboard where she kept her jars, I hid and played my pranks. In my mind's eye, like a wild tiger, I waited for my chance to seize the unsuspecting prey and begin my ferocious dance. My mother would shriek and spin about pretending she might die, and I would laugh and hold her tight, my claws buried in her side. Was this the game my father played when he went out at night? I suspect the answer has always been in the periphery of my sight. <laughs> 